my name is Caitlin with West Palm Dog, and today I'm here with Pino as well as my volunteer Jasmine, and we're working on some more recall and picking up Pino. Now Pino's been doing really good with this exercise, and today we're turning it up a notch because we're using another person because we want to make sure that Pino understands. Doesn't matter who's picking him up, doesn't matter what state of mind he's in, he has to be able to stay still to be picked up politely. So what we're going to be doing is some monkey in the middle recall, so we're going to be calling him back and forth, and just like we discussed, both Jasmine and I are going to treat him for the recall, but we're also going to treat him and pick him up underhandedly. The reason why I'm picking him up underhandedly is to increase the chances that he's not going to back away. And this will also help him feel more comfortable when being picked up. So we're going to go ahead and just practice calling him back and forth. Pino! Come! Yes, good boy. So I'm treating once for the recall, and now I'm going to hold another treat, pick him up. Yes, good boy. And you see, I'm just using my other hand just to stabilize him. I'm not going over him with my hands. I'm just picking him up there underhand with one hand to stabilize. Now Jasmine's going to call him. Good job. And you see, Jasmine's saying yes as he walks over because that'll mark the behavior to keep coming over to us. And you see, she's able to pick him up. No problem. There's no backing up. Really nice. You know, come. Yes, good boy. See, I'm treating for that recall. I'm going to turn to the side over here so you can get a better view. You see, I'm just putting my hand under him, picking him up. Yes, good boy. All right, Jasmine's going to call. See, he gets really excited by recall. That's really why I want to emphasize that even if he's excited, we still want to be able to pick him up. She's giving her a little bit of trouble. So you see, she's just using her food just to lure him. He did back up a little bit, but you saw she was able to use her food, get him in range, and pick him up politely. That's why it's really important that we're not picking him up overhandedly to prevent that backing up. We're going to do that one more time. Pino! Come! Yes, good boy. I'm going to go ahead and get my other treat ready. Yes, good boy. That was a really nice job from Pino. You can see even though that last one, he was a little skittish, he did back up a little bit. He didn't, he was able to be lured back. And overall, he didn't dash away from us, which is really important because he's had a habit of doing that in the past. Overall, very nice job from Pino. He's made a lot of progress. Really nice job.